Just a few days after the San Bernardino terrorist attacks, President Obama speaks to the nation from the Oval Office. I will urge high-tech and law enforcement leaders to make it harder. But not addressing what many were expecting or hoping to hear. What's new? It didn't seem like he said anything new. We know we're at war with ISIS. We know there are terrorists uh, to get us. We already knew of this. Um, for him to call a special speech tonight, uh, just to reiterate that, it just uh, doesn't make sense. Political analyst John Dadian says the goal of tonight's address was to help the American people feel safe or reassure us that things were being done to keep us safe, something Dadian argues Obama didn't do. Our success won't depend on tough talk or abandoning our values or giving in to fear. That's what groups like ISIL are hoping for. Instead, we will prevail by being strong and smart, resilient and relentless, and by drawing upon every aspect of American power. In his 13-minute speech, Obama discussed, among other things, the ongoing investigation in San Bernardino, the threat of terrorism, how it is evolving, and his commitment to defeat ISIS. One thing he said that he was adamant about, uh, which I know a lot of Americans support, is uh, no ground troops in any of the Middle East regions. But in the end, for people like Dadian, Obama's words were disappointing and not soon enough.